hi guys i just want to do some kind of unboxing and testing at the same time of the single phase electronic measuring module uh, that i bought it just arrived and i'm going to be testing it with these 9.5 volt energy saving bulb uh, i removed it from this lamp but i'm going to be putting it back and connecting it to the module it's a dim rail module basically let's pop this up from, from the package so this is it And I'm going to be putting it to test to confirm if the measurement that is going to be given to me, the readings, is going to be accurate. So I'm going to get right straight to business. What I'm going to do, I will connect this plug and the wire to this um, watt meter that I've got here as well. It gives the amps and the, and the voltage and uh, i'm going to connect it to the input voltage point here and then connect the lamp to the output so i'm going to get right on with this and let's see what we've got all right i've got some of my tools right here i've got my screwdriver just going to pull this aside now i have to go through the manual i come to understand that any part of it can be the intake and the and the output so the input and the output but i'm just gonna make use of this part and just uh, position it in the upright manner and right here you will need to make sure that this um harness this plate here comes out and you just insert it on the inside you've got the line and the neutral so alright guys perfect so one part is in and I need to connect this one as well which is going to be the load and I'm going to connect to this and we're going to put it to a test so let me get that done okay i think i've got this solution in place and i'm going to plug this in now and here we are got 240 volt let me see if i can move this camera just to see now i bought the one with the backlight but for some reason this is not showing any backlight and so currently there's no power because I've not inserted the uh, the bulb, the energy bulb, but just want to show that it's reading. My only disappointment here, I'm sorry, my only disappointment here is the fact that it's not showing the backlight. I'm going to try to position this on a platform so that uh, I can capture this properly on the camera. All right, so the only disappointment here is the fact that when I ordered this, I ordered the one with the backlight, but this one is not showing no backlight. As you can see, the, the data changes, so it's not the one that you can see everything on the, on the monitor, but it changes, so you have to hold on to see. So currently, 240 volts, 0.6 is coming in. the peak voltage 
the cloud hour there's nothing connected at the moment and I think there's the amps and the pick words so I'm gonna connect uh, the 9.5 volts um, energy bulb here to the lamp and let's see if the reading will be accurate All right, guys. So the LED light is 9.5 watts. And let's see what we've got here. So showing 9.6 watt, 9.5, which is kind of accurate. I'm just trying to get some more light to the screen here. All right. I think this is more of a proper measurement. So the voltage, the current, so it's zero current, 9.5 watt, that's kind of accurate, but in terms of current, it seems not to be showing anything. Normally I would expect at least 0 0.1 or except if the amperage is um, like something like 0, 0.00 0 something. Well, but the best way to calculate that is to uh, divide the amperage by the voltage that is coming through and see what that should be. All right, guys. So the reason why we're not seeing any amps there is because what we should be getting in terms of uh, from the 9.5 watt bulb, the amp should be around 0 0.03. So this in terms of the decimal point, that is why this seems to be showing 0.0. .0. So by and large, it's working fine. I'm just disappointed because it doesn't have the backlight. So I'm not sure whether I want to return this or I want to claim a refund or something. Uh, it came all the way from China, but it seems to be a good piece of equipment at the moment. All right, that would conclude this part of the video. So um, I will share some more information as to where I bought it from. And if you want to purchase, you can uh, click on the link in the description below. Thank you guys. I think it's a very good equipment. Have a good day. Bye-bye.